Religion. You, you saw some other reports that you... Yeah, could, religious documents. Uh, uh, pretty hard to, to swallow? Very hard to swallow. Saying, basically, that... Uh, basically, that we're a product of genetic engineering from someone... Yeah. Yeah, how, but how can you just swallow that whole? Well, how can you swallow any of that, though? Well, it's easy to swallow things you can put your hands on and touch and, and then work with. That's no problem. But when you get into uh, a lot of spiritual stuff and religion and, you know, you were brought here and this is, we were made by uh, progressive corrections and evolution and that sort of thing. And uh, where it shoots down a lot of the established religions, you know, Catholicism, and, and, and everything that, you know, are essentially your, it's a tough thing to accept. And, you know, why, without, you know, hardcore proof, why even... Why even bring it up? I, I guess the question more should deal with that you actually read a report that said this stuff. Well, yeah, the only hardcore thing is that there is an extremely classified document dealing with religion, and it's about that thing, period. But why would there be any classified material dealing with religion? That's the only thing that you can say. What other kinds of classified? Autopsy. Pre autopsy. No, that wasn't the last subject. I want to go back to the religion thing. I want you to say it. Oh, come on, that's so weird. That says a lot. That's I'm not asking you to say what you believe to be a fact. I'm asking you to say what you read in a report that it's a, that is distributed at what may be the most top secret facility in the world. Okay. All right. Um, All right, I'll say it. It just, it's so, it's so far out. It, it's, uh, All it's right, your objection has been noted. Okay. What does it say? That we're containers. That's how, that's how supposedly the aliens look at us. That we are nothing but containers. Containers of? Containers. Maybe containers of souls. You can come up with whatever theory you want, but we're containers. And that's how we're mentioned in the documents. Um, that religion was specifically created, so we have some rules and regulations for the sole purpose of not damaging the containers. The souls. Meaning well, the souls or the bodies, whatever. I, that's, that's meaning like we're, uh, we're containers for souls that they're going to use at some other point. Right. And that they have something to do with uh, pro different prophets and, and biblical figures. Yes. <laughs> well, <laughs> that, that uh, supposedly uh, Jesus and two other... Uh, uh, two other beings were genetically engineered. They were implanted in people on Earth in biblical times, and their uh, births were closely monitored. Now, just some little connections to that that my wife had brought up were um, uh, in the Bible. They said that uh, uh, the star had followed Mary. Uh, wherever she went, and uh, you know that all UFO sightings always start out as people. Well, gee, that looks like a bright star, and uh, well, in fact, they said in the Bible, the brightest star in the sky followed her where she went, and uh, you just make little connections like that. Uh, okay, I don't know what else to, to right. touch on about. We uh, we were talking about how 